Gamers, say dog is Shirata here, and welcome to our first episode of our Pokemon Mr. Dungeon X4 Pokemon Mr. Dungeon X4 the Sky Let's Play. Now, I have been dying to play this game on the channel ever since I ever since I let's play the Burbage team. I, mean, I have been wanting to do X4 the Sky, and now I finally get to do it. Uh, I had to wait a while because, um I had two series going on on the channel. I had my New Super Mario Bros. 2 Let's Play, and then I had my Pokemon X Master Lock. And so I decided to like, just um, just make it to work where I... Mm, I was fin you want know, to finish out New Super Mario Bros. 2, because it's not that long. Real quick, all, I got this entire week, I, I just like um, really binge uh, recorded um, New Super Mario Bros. 2. And then we moved on to what is now New uh, what is now po uh, Pokemon Mission Legends Next World Sky. Let's go ahead and hit new game. Where we're taking the personality quiz, as always. It's like the last game in our uh, rest team. Welcome. This fort this is the fort that leads to the world of Pokemon. Inhabited only by Pokemon. I should probably do this. Uh, da, da, da. There we go. This is the fort that leads to the world inhabited only by Pokemon. Beyond this gateway, you may many new adventures and fresh experiences await your arrival. Before you depart for your adventure, you must answer some questions. Be truthful when you answer them. Are you ready? Now, are you ready? Then, let the questions begin. Did you play X Force? Okay, did you play X Force Time or X Force Darkness? Uh, uh, I was saying, well, no, I'm not going for any typical particular Pokemon anyway, so no. Do you think of it's? And I, I actually not play on the Force Time or Force Darkness. I actually did uh, when I was a kid. But for this one. Do you think it's important to have to always aim to, the, to be the best? Of course. Do you like karaoke? <laughs> I've actually never done karaoke before, but like to be honest, I uh, I'm a very shy person. But like, to, um, I would say no. You're packing your classroom snacks for a pan for a, for a picnic when you get hungry. What do you do? <laughs> Eat just a tiny bit. Hold myself back and pack it up. Pack it all up. What's the next? They're in my belly. <laughs> I would probably be that one guy and say, and probably be, I'd probably be that one guy and be, be, and say, what's the next? They're in my belly. I would literally, I, that's, that's just that's something I would do. Cause like when I get hungry, I get hungry. Like I'll eat anything. Trust me, it's like um, it's like uh, I'm I'm uh, around me, legit. But to be honest, if, I, if I'm speaking legitimately, I would say hold myself back and pack pack it all up. The phones ringing. What do you do? Answer right away. Wait a bit before answering. Ignore it and let it ring. Well. If it's a house phone, I I don't really answer. I, I don't really answer. Whenever I'm at home, because I'm home alone right now. Whenever, because uh, whenever the house phone goes off, that means it's it's um you're not supposed to touch it. You know that because it's all it's all business re business related for my parents. So I would actually ignore it and let it ring. Because I don't really, uh, no one really calls me on my phone. So your friend is, has it has made a has made uh, made a meal that tastes terrible. They ask you how what is it. You say terrible. Just smile or um, it's good. <laughs> Well, to be uh, well, to be fair, um, Alex, because I know he's watching this right now. <laughs> I will probably if, if Alex ever made me something that's for me to eat, because uh, he's my he's my he's my my, uh, my boy. So like uh, like if, if he ever made anything for me to, like or something something my, my buddy uh, Jesus, if he if they, if either one of them ever made something for me to eat and it tastes bad, I would tell him straight up like, dude, this is bad. Like I don't like this at all. I wouldn't tell him straight up, but like, I see him, I don't really know, because it's a key the moment I didn't, would not know what to say. Like, whether or not I would say, like, it's bad or it's good. So I would say maybe, just, I would probably just smile and be like, 
Like, yeah, it's good, it's okay. It's, like, legit. You've been invited to a wonderful party. It's time for the, for the party to start. But there's nobody here. Or nobody, uh, nobody there. You think, did something happen? Maybe I have the day wrong? Let's get this party started. <laughs> um, let's get this party started. Nope. <laughs> uh, maybe I had the day wrong. Or I, I'll probably say, did, did something happen? I'll probably say, maybe I had the day wrong. You see a big, comfortable bed. You first, the first, your first reaction is to jump on it, belly flop, or curl up. I'll probably curl up in it. Have you ever thought of that if you dug in, in your backyard, you could find buried treasure? Uh, I don't have a backyard because I live in an apartment, so no. Oh, you're male or female? Male. Of course. Alright, let's see what I get. Oops. <laughs> your aura, okay, so now your aura will be analyzed. Your aura is the energy that you radiate. Relax. Calm yourself. And j now press your fingertip gently on the bow. That's right. Stay perfectly still. Take a deep breath. And now exhale. Your aura has not been identified. Your aura is... A stainless silver. That does not surprise me. Thank you for asking all those questions. You seem to be the lonely type. At least a little bit. You might find that that's, that's surprising, but you, do you think it might be a little true? You know what they what they, what they say though. If you were all uh, a bit uh, a bit lonely every now and then. You probably keep you 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 probably keep this fact keep this fact of li of life to yourself though. But if there's no, no, one th one thing that, that brings us all together, it's our need to to be, to go solo, to to, to go it solo. So lonely and solitary type like you would be a bulb star. Hmm. All right. Well, the, the last installment of uh, uh, the last time we the game of Rescue Team, I I, I got Mudkip, and so I don't mind bulb star. Bulb star's cool. And finally, who will be your partner? Choose Pokemon you want to for your partner. Okay, so, let's see here, we got Muslax, Charmander, Squirtle, Pikachu, Cyndaquil, Tordile, Torchic, Mudkip, Chimchar, Piplup, Eevee, and Shinx. And then we also have Meowth, Skitty, Vulpix, Vampy, and Riolu. Now, um, if I'm speaking, well, if I'm already thinking about it, there isn't, like, there isn't a really, like, a whole lot of Pokemon you can, like, um, really, like, make friends with. In this game, but like, if I were to choose like one of my partners, cause last because last um, the uh, last match of the game versus team, I picked um, Zinnical as, as a partner, and so um, PHG is gonna be too hard to use. Uh, Squirtle could be useful for when we go up against fire types, for um, because that's Bulbasaur's weakness. Um, he's not very helpful with ice types though, so maybe we should bring along Charmander. So definitely, I would definitely, I would definitely to have like a, fem a female with me as well. But like, for, they only, they're only um, Torchic and Eevee, and also Skitty and Vulpix. But um, hmm. do I want a Vulpix though? Hmm. Hmm. I'm gonna go, you know what? I'm gonna pick Chimchar. I never use Chimchar. So, um, in uh, any. I haven't ever actually played the Gym, the gym 4 game, so I'm just, gonna, I'm just gonna pick Chimchar. And I, I have the perfect name for him, too. I'm gonna call him Chimchar. Okay, so what's, what should I call Chimchar? Um, let's call him. Huh. Let's name him. Let's name him Abu. That seems like a good, uh, a good name. Abu. Do I? Hmm. Yeah, that's a good name. I'll call. I'll call him that. Okay, that's it. You're all ready to go. You're off to the world of Pokemon. Be strong. Stay smart and be victorious. Wow. Okay, let's just move along. It's fine. Chapter 1, A Storm at Sea.
Whoa, 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 whoa. Are, are you okay? No, don't let go. Just a little longer. Come on, hang on. N no, I can't. Hold on. Why? Lipsies. Er. Where? Where am I? I can't. Drifting off. What? Okay, so what, what should I get? What voice should I give a boo? No! I refuse to be paralyzed with this any longer! No more whipping out! I have to be brave today! Pokemon tempted. Pokemon tempted. Alright, excuse for that, for that um, abrupt cut. My timer went off my other, on my phone, so I just go, I had to go uh, turn it off. I have laundry in the dryer, so I'm gonna go pick. I'm gonna go pick that up I, right after this recording is done. Pokemon detected. Pokemon detected. Who's footprint? Who's footprint? The footprint is Chimchars. The footprint is Chimchars. Wow! Uh, that shocked me. Ha ha ha! Wow! I can't. I can't push myself into going new after all. I said to myself that this this is the day, but. I thought that, the, that holding on to my to my personal treasure would inspire me. Uh, but I just can't do it. I'm such a coward. This is so discouraging. Uh, that's a decent monkey voice, wasn't it? What'd you guys say? Hey, Zubad. Let me switch camera again. Hey, Zubad. Get, did you get a load of that? You bet I did, coughing. That little whip was for where that was pacing around. Has something good, right? That whip has something, something else for sure. It looks like some kind of treasure. Do we go after it? We do. Oh wait, there we go. Nope. Uh, nope. Leave it, leave it, leave it, leave it. Live editing, guys. Live editing. Mm -hmm. Wow! What an impressive sight! Okay, that's the first time I've ever heard that. Those lines before. Oh, I thought I mean. Hmm. When the water is good, then uh -huh, Grabby and come out, come out at this ascendant to blow bubbles. All those bubbles catching the wave, catching the setting sun, setting sun's rays off the of the waves. It's always impressive. This is where I always end up when I'm feeling sorry for myself. But it makes me feel good to be here, like always. Coming here cheers me up. Hey, what's that? What's going on over, the, uh, over there? What? Someone has collapsed in the sand. What happened? Are you okay? Ugh. 
great! You're awake! Very good. I need to work on that voice. Where, where am I? You were moving. You really had me worried there. How did you wind up unconscious out here? I, I was unconscious. What happened? Anyway, I'm Abu. Great, I'm glad to meet you. So you might, so you might be. So who might you be? I don't think I've seen your face around here before. Huh? You say you're a human? You like? You look l like a totally normal Bulbasaur to me. Uh, it's true. I've turned into a Bulbasaur. But how did this happen? I don't remember anything. You're a little odd. Are you pulling some kind of trick on me? No. <laughs> You're telling me the truth? Okay then, what's your name? What do you call yourself? My name? That's right, my name is... Well, the last misjudging game, I call myself Steven, which is actually is my, my real name. But I'm gonna go ahead and go with the preferred name, which is Sadok. It's funny how how, how Sadog is um appropriate. No, uh, oh, Sadog is your name. Okay. Well, you don't seem to be a bad be a bad Pokemon at least. Sorry, I doubt, that doubted you. More of my bad Pokemon uh, have been turning up lately. You see, a lot of Pokemon ha have started uh, have started to be being aggressive lately. Things have been gone in a while for 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 some reason. Well, I do beg your pardon. Hey, why did you do that? Hey, <laughs> hey, can't figure it out. We wanted to mess with you. Can't face up to us, can you? M what? That's that's yours, isn't it? Eh, uh, hey, that's. Sorry, kiddo. We'll take that. Ah, uh, you know. There you go. Whoa! Not gonna make a move to get that back. What's the matter? Too scared? I didn't expect that you'd be such a big coward. Come on, let's get out of here. See you around, chicken. <laughs> oh. What should I do? That's my personal treasure. It means everything to me. If I lose that. No. This isn't a waste. I have to get it back. Hey, will you help me? Of course. Really? You really help? Thank you. Let's go quickly. Alright, Beach Key. Basic first floor. Head for the stairway as you go. Uh, uh, as you go, you can attack enemies by pressing A. Enemies won't move or act until you do. Okay, first thing. First of all, let's go to open up the X menu and then go to options. Okay, so the bottom screen needs to change. Bottom screen, I'm on the top screen. Sorry, it needs to change to team stats. And the bottom screen, keep a clear map, I guess, for now. Grids on. Um, do, 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 do. All right, we're good. Yes. Poke is the world's money, and save it to, uh, to buy useful items for your adventure. Let me see if we can turn and face this guy. All right, what are my moves? Tackle and growl. Okay, so let's step forward. Then, what are you saying? Alright, let's go ahead and set tackle. Shut phone. I'm actually not in my room. I'm actually in the living room. room so I'm home alone. So, this is going to be a lot more of an echo. I still, my, I still have my headphones on, but still. You can carry one item. The items you, you find on, on the floor have a variety of useful effects. 
you find an item, you open the, the menu with X. Then use the, uh, the, the items option to see what, what it does. Ah, okay. I actually have played this game before, so... There we go. Bum 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 bum. Yes, in some areas, you will see a ground with tile with a green arrow. It's called a warning tile. Stop on, step on it to, to heal, get any stat changes. Blast seed. Okay, you can eat. You can eat a blast seed to breathe fire at the target in front of you. You to use it. Open the menu. Select it from from items, and then then select eat. Jeez, all you gotta do, all you gotta do is ta was lightly um, tackle. You don't have to scratch it, you know. Have questions about anything? You can check the, uh, out uh, quick hints by opening the menu with uh, with X. Then select, select, selecting others to find the hints uh, op option. I guess. Wait, hold up. I didn't actually change the text speed as fast today. Text speed fast. I mean, uh, options. Okay. Go to speed fast. Yes. Cinder Blast Seed. That's fine. I'm waiting that. Now go away. Eh. Eh. Oh, come on. There you go. Oops. Ooh, serious. Mine. I'm go serious. There you go. Oh, right at the end already. Beach Cape Pit. Already. Mm -hmm. Uh, hey! Ha 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 ha. Okay. I really need to work on that voice. Well, well, well. If it isn't our old friend, the big chicken. Uh, g give me. Give me back what you stole from me. That's my precious treasure. It means everything to me. Treasure, you s treasure, you see. So that uh, that thing is is really is valuable, huh? It could be worth more than we'd hoped for. I say, we ought to try selling it. Who knows? It might be a get a good price. Whoa! All the more reason not to give it back. What? If you want, if you want it back, and back that badly, come and get it. <laughs> All right. Let's go ahead and fight. And then tax so can come forward a little bit. I'm gonna check the um I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to focus on, on the uh watch the watch the well, watch what this is. I'm gonna eat. There we go. Okay, you're gonna copying. And then it, boom. A boo gets rid of um Zubat for us. Oh, oh. Uh. We got roughed up. That you did. But blast it! How do we get whipped, uh, wiped out by a uh, by wimps like you them? Bah! Here, here, you go. Take it then. Whoa! Don't think you're you're so awesome. Your victory was a fluke. Yeah, you should remember that. <laughs> oh, it's oh, it's my rock fragment. Am I ever glad? I actually managed to get it back. It's all because of, it's because uh, you were here there to, to help me, Sidog. Thanks, Sidog. Yeah, I helped for once. Really, really, thank you. I only hope because I happened to be there. Was that the right thing to do? I guess so. This Pokemon is clearly grateful. It's nice and appreciated. Yeah, it is. Here's what they stole. This is my this is a relic fragment. Well, at least that's what I started calling it. Bone shut up. But this uh, but this relic fragment is for precious treasure. You see, I've always liked legends and lore. I always get so excited when I when I hear tales from the past. Don't you feel the same way? Hidden droves of full of treasure and strange relics. Uncharted territories, filled in darkness, and new lands were just waiting to, to be discovered. Such places must be full of gold and treasure. 
and history, wouldn't it be amazing to, to, to make historic discoveries? I always dream about that. It's all exciting to me. So one day, I happened to, to find my rug, uh, find something. My rug fragment. Um, so it sure it looks like junk, but take a closer look. See? See that strange pattern inscribed on it? It's true. There is a strange inscription. I've never seen a pattern like this. This pattern must must have some meaning to it. I'm sure of it. This relic fragment must be the the key to, to legendary places, to areas where precious treasure lies. At least that's the feel I get. That's why I joined. The, uh, that's why I want to join the uh, an exploration team. This fragment must fit into something somewhere. I want to discover what that where that is. I want to solve the mystery of my relic fragment. So earlier, I tried joining an exploration team as, a print as an apprentice, but I chickened out. What about you, Sinaka? What are you going to do now? You lost your memory. You lost your memory and you somehow transformed into a Pokemon. Do you have anywhere to go and stay after this? Surprisingly, I don't. Hmm. If not, can I ask a big favor? Would you join me to make an exploration team? I think you and I would make a good exploration team, say dog. So how about it? We can come on, please. Whoa, what should I do? I'm getting recruited out of the blue. I don't know what an exploration team is. What should I do? Should I just should I join this Pokemon and form an exploration team? Yes, form a team. It's true. I do not. I don't have anywhere to go. I don't have nowhere to go. I do have nowhere to go. Okay, this is it. I don't have any clue what, what should I what I should do next. I guess it wouldn't hurt to team with with that boo for now. Maybe I'll eventually discover who or what I am by hanging out with this Pokemon. Okay, that's awesome. Yeah? Really? You'll form an exploration team with me? Yahoo! Thanks! But we're, we're going to, to we're going to make a great great combination. Let's get let's make this work. First, the, let's go to the World Testament place to sign up as apprentices. That's where we can train to, to become a proper exploration team. I think the training will be really tough. But let's let's give it our best, you know? Yeah. <laughs> And so, there we go. Abu and Seog formed an exploration team. This turned out to be their very first step into many fantastic uh, realms of adventure that uh, awaited their arrival. Bum, 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 bum. Would you like to save adventure? Yes. As I save here, we are going to end off on this abrupt cliffhanger and move on to the next episode. Would, um, if you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget like, comment, and subscribe. So right now, we'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.